Good evening everyone, welcome back to my channel, my name is Jellybean, and we are back today starting our campaign as France. Um, I'm excited to play as France, I've never played as them before, so um, I'm uh, I'm looking forward to, to seeing what we are able to do with them. Um, we're also in a good spot to, to do some colonization, and I guess we did, did a little bit with the uh, Angevin Empire, Angevin Kingdom. Um, playthrough that we did but otherwise I mean for the most part we haven't done any colonization since we played as Portugal so I'm looking forward to being able to uh, to do that there are a few achievements that I want to get first one is uh, to get all the French cores um, we need to own Vienna Berlin and Moscow for better than Napoleon and then finally I do want to try to get the uh, the big blue blob where we need to own 100 European core provinces before uh, 1500 so we are going to do that um, I'll let you guys pause here and read this if you want um, and then we already did our estate stuff um, for the clergy we did religious state uh, clerical advisory council church sanctuaries and religious diplomats nobility uh, primacy of the nobility aristocratic counselors French strong duchies, which we already started with, and finally supremacy over the crown. And then down here, land of commerce, um, commercial advisory board indebted to the bourgeoisie, free enterprise, and patronage of the arts. Um, I did also look at doing increased levies for the nobility, but by giving this out, uh, they are exempt from seized land, and they're already super influential, and having them keep 63% of their, um, 63% of the, the estate land in the country, they're going to remain super influential, and I don't, I really don't want to try and deal with that, so we'll leave it for now. Hopefully we don't run into issues with manpower. I'm sure we will a little bit, but hopefully it's not too bad. Let's summon the diet, seize land quick. Um... Papal states influence of France is a hundred. I would actually, I wouldn't mind doing that one. Maine, what is Maine? Okay, only five years of separatism. I don't care then. Otherwise, base production for seventy-seven ducats. Um. Oh, okay. So would we rather do this or the yearly papal influence, or would we rather do this for the seventy-seven ducats? We do have a decent amount of money right now, and we're not going to be spending a whole bunch of it right off the bat, so I think we're going to go with this one. Um, try to get our papal influence up right away so we can start selecting uh, some of these. So let's come here. Let's do advisors first. Uh, we do have two half-off guys up here, a stab cost and a yearly inflation reduction. Um... This guy's 59, and this guy's only 38, so I think we are going to pick Jacques here. We do have a half-off level 2 improved relations guy, so we'll take him as well. And then... No half-off guys here, and unfortunately, the only level 1 that we have is this reinforced speed guy. That's... Really unfortunate, but it is what it is, so we'll take him, I guess. And then we are already focused on Diplo. Part of me thinks we should focus on Admin instead, since we're going to be coring up so many provinces. Um, plus then it helps us get through our Admin tech sooner, so we'll focus on Admin, I guess. I don't know if that's the right choice. Uh, not here. Right here, we got a set of rivals. Definitely England. Aragon's fine. I don't have an issue with that. And we are not rivaling Burgundy. So we will leave that slot empty for the time being. Um, let's get you marching here. You marching here. And let's hire the free company. Right there, I guess. And then we do need a couple more transports, and then we'll out. 
Or the rest galleys, and then we're out of sailors. We can't build any more. Soon we can. Um, in a month, actually, we can build another galley. So, um, right off the bat, let's... I guess expand all of these first. And then come up and we'll ally the Pope. We'll start currying favors with Provence. And then with this one, we're going to Royal Mary or Leon. So that way they become loyal again. We'll just speed four for the time being. And let's just Royal Mary the rest of our appanages. Come on. Be four and five down here. Okay. Come on. There we go. And the last one's right here. And then once we get this diplomat back, we will improve relations with Burgundy because we do want to go for the Burgundian um, succession. And. I don't know if there's anything else I care to do right now. Um, I could have done this before and gotten a maybe gotten a little bit of extra prestige, but kind of thinking we should send. Ooh, never mind. Don't say we should send an insult to England. But no, that's dumb because we're going to war with England here shortly. Oh, uh, I forgot to give. There, I forgot to give out uh, generals, so let's, oh, we can ally Castile, so let's go ahead and ally them as well. And then... Gotta keep this guy free. Alright. So we can go to war with uh, with England right away. Provence wants a royal marriage. Um, I'm fine accepting that. Tyrone, Kildare, Portugal. Alright, yeah, I don't care. So... Could call Provence in with the promise of land? Oh yeah, because they can take Maine. Never mind, I'm not I'm not gonna call them in. Um I th think we should probably be fine. Let's set Laborde as our target here, war goal. And go to war. Get you guys in. Let's actually get you in. And Jean Biro, we need to win four battles with him, so um but there did forget to set this as well, so let's set these guys to siege. I don't know if I want them to siege like I don't know if it's better for them to siege or if it's better for them to be supportive, but I guess for the time being we can set them to siege. And I would love to move my navy out. But I know for a f fact that uh, England's and Portugal's combined navy is stronger than us, so we're not even going to worry about it. I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing any English. Oh shit! I'm wasting our fucking diplomat. Need to be improving relations with probably Orleone. Let's do the Pope instead, though. We can try and finish that. We just need to get him to 100. Um, I'm not seeing any English troops up here, so... I'm wondering if they're not down here in... Portugal's, but I don't see... England's troops at all. So yeah, like I said, I'm wondering if they're down here in... Yes, they are. I just saw them get delivered. 
And there's no chance of them joining, unfortunately. So... Hopefully we can win this siege here quickly. Come on. We're at 35. Not terrible. And you know, maybe it's not that bad that uh, that these armies are down here because we can tra trap them down here then and... Maybe wipe them out. Plus, also, it lets our subjects siege down the forts up there. 49%. Can we win it, please? Nope. Of course not. Um. Hey, there we go. Alright. Retake Gascony? What does this do for us? They will be cheaper to demand in a peace deal. Oh no, we are definitely going to uh, going to wait for that. Um, okay, I'm assuming yeah we can walk through here. All right, so let's grab all of these guys and. I guess let's just move them to Vizcaya for now. Lautach. Who's here? Armagnac. So Armagnac, let's set you to be supportive, please. I think the rest of these guys have those two forts. I really need your help. Jean Biro we need. Hopefully this counts as victories for him then if we are able to beat, beat these guys up. It's highlands, farmlands, highlands. Let's just go to Palencia for now and see where they go from there. When do they arrive? December 11th. Right there. Perfect, actually. I think. Yes. They're locked in, so let's move in. Hopefully we can win here pretty quickly. Uh, I don't think we're going to win this. Oh, well, maybe if Armagnac gets in here, we can win. Come on, Armagnac. Hey, we did win. All right. That's actually really good for us. Now let's... Actually, first, let me check down here. Make sure that counted as a victory for him. Yes, perfect. Okay. Alright, so let's start moving this way. I'm assuming they're going there, so I'm going to try to move there as well. Hopefully we can catch somebody. Fuck, we can't. Oh, man. Well... Level 3, unfortunately. <sighs> Balls. Let's move you to Lisboa. We can keep you there. Sure. Just stay here like this, I guess. We actually need to get down here. Maybe that's what we should 
try to wor uh, work on instead. Yeah, let's try to get down here. Maybe we can catch their armies separated a little bit. Fucking bastard. And now the English have troops up here as well. That's not good for us. Oh, one of our ships got... That's fucking annoying. Please, can we catch up to these guys? <sighs> I don't like that their armies are separated. Or, uh, are down here, I mean. Okay, we can recall from the Pope. Let's go up to speed 5, because this is annoying me how long it's taking. Alright, that's not bad, because they're going to trap themselves on this fort, so I'm actually fine with that. Back wipe? Yes. Oh, you fucking dickhead Burgundy. Why the fuck would you rival me? I doubt we had enough to royal marry them, but who fucking knows? Maybe we did. Alright, I want all of these guys to be supportive, please. And then part of me wants to come up here and beat up the English Navy, or uh, Army, I mean. I'm going to. Oh, good, we didn't lose our fucking three siege guy. The Bureau. There we go. And the English don't have anywhere else to go. Perfect. This gives us, for 15 years, assault fort, artillery level, but then we get some artillery in Paris. That is exactly what we needed. So let's get these guys attached here. You are probably going to be going to uh Lisboa, so we'll uh, we'll stick with them for now. Fortunately, we weren't able to actually get there, so let's select you, detach you, and hopefully you can get down there before anybody uh, blockades that area. Right, good, I just wanted to make sure because kind of looked like for a second there they were still following us. Sensia. Okay, what does this do? National tax that goes down, or because we're well advised, we can get some prestige. All right, yeah, we're definitely doing that one then. 
Okay. I'm an idiot because I keep forgetting that we need to improve relations with these people. We could call in Provence. I do not want to. Tyrone's landing some troops. Alright, so somebody down here, maybe Orleone. Actually, everybody, just stop being supportive, please. No, 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 I lied. Keep being supportive until the end of this battle. There we go. Now I'll go back to sieging. And I don't know if this guy's going to... <laughs> retreat here, or if he's going to come down here. Either way, we're going to have to siege this fort down, so... Let's just siege this fort down. Ah, fine. Stop along, attach. Just go there. <sighs> well, I guess we can recall from Burgundy. Unfortunately, they kind of hate us now. That really sucks, because I really didn't want to deal with uh, them being rivaled to me. Uh, how do we get rid of that? God damn, they've got a shit ton of fucking allies. Way more than I think we could deal with. Unfortunately, because we really needed that. You attached again because for whatever reason you decided to stop being attached. Gotta get across, please. Gotta get across, please. Yes, thank you. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, with this guy, let's start improving with maybe a Vern. I think I've earned the, the way to go. Fortunately, or Orleone just got beat up there. Scotland declared war on England. Okay. Well, since they did that, let's... I want to revoke the guarantee. That way we can go to war here shortly, and then we'll come back and... Keep improving with Orleon. Hopefully we can win the Siege of Lisboa here shortly. Um, build some more galleys. Which we're going to need, so... Let's do that. That's probably fine. Oh fuck, we're out of manpower. Eesh. Hopefully here soon then we can stop to help conserve some manpower and to make things go a little bit quicker. Let's pull these guys off. Uh, sure. There we go, Siege of Liz's bow is over, so let's keep sieging this shit down. You to Algarve. You there. And this is pretty much going to be it then. There we go. Alright. 
Let's attach you, allow attach here, and let's start moving these guys up here. Got 16,000. All right. Yeah, let's get going. We are going to have to deal with these couple armies, which isn't that big of a deal. We just have to win that siege and we're good. England, War of the Roses. Alright, I want... Everybody here to go back to being supportive, please. Siege of Suetha is over. So let's immediately start marching you up there, please. Because we are going to need... Oh, we fucking won. Barely. And I didn't see if they got rid of Naples or not. I'm assuming they did. They did. Alright. Okay, so that should be Portugal's entire army. It is. So now you guys, let's come up here. We're gonna have to siege main back. So... We'll take out these rebels. Fuck, they got that port. That's a little unfortunate. It is what it is. Okay, so let's just siege main back. Ooh, we do actually need money. Okay. Let's get you guys up here then. Um, hopefully we're fine. On, please, for fuck's sake. Ten ducats, Jesus. Yeah, I guess we can lose the prestige. And I don't need to shift consolidate there. We can here, and we can here. So let's do that and then head in. Their subjects are coming in as well to help. That's good. I have a feeling they're going there. Or maybe just to Alenson. Alright. So that's those armies wiped out again. Move you there. Move you there. Stop doing that. Everybody else. Go back to siege, please. Because... I would much rather they waste their manpower sieging this stuff down. Um. Oh, right there, I bet Portugal got some troops. So, uh, let's come down here. marching you guys down here as well. How much manpower are we down? Um, I actually don't want to pay for this. Give you the flaw, please. Same thing here, just give you the flaw. Losing nine ducats per month. Fuck. Turn this off. You know, we probably don't need to do this. Probably just need to wait for this to finish. Yes. Fortunately. Let's 
So once this fort finishes, we'll be fine. Chase him down with this guy. Okay. So we've got you going there, you going there. It's not a stack whip, unfortunately. Hopefully this one will be. Just took a loan. That was. Just do something like this, I guess. There we go. Okay. This army is completely destroyed right now, unfortunately. I am really surprised that they did that, but whatever. All right, let's speed five through this, and then we'll end the war and finish the episode. Um, yeah, Scotland is absolutely destroying England right now, which is maybe good. Grab somebody and come up here and try and... Let's just try and loot a little bit. Neither one of these two has anything. This bow doesn't either, so... Probably better off doing something like this. If we want to loot, yeah. Oh. Finish that siege, actually. Let's pull back from Avern. And I need... This province back. I need this province back. Do for peace, take that, take that. I do want Ceuta. Hopefully I can still take Pale. I can. Can't take much else. It might be worth taking some money. Yeah, probably. And it might actually be worth piecing Portugal out separately for the money. It's gonna cost a little bit of Diplo, but I think that's fine. I don't think I need anything else down here. No, definitely not. Alright. War reps, money, whatever, there we go, so... Those ones are done, now we can have you come up here. And... I'll sue for peace with you. And we can take a lot more money now. Which... I will do. Alright, send that demand. Perfect. So let's start coring this up. I will keep the fort there. Um, I'm gonna mothball this fort. I think it's useless. So we'll do that. Move everybody here, because we are gonna be moving troops across right away to Ireland. Um... Are the owns at 169? Could we annex them? 1454. Unfortunately, not. Let's start, start rooting out some corruption, I guess. And then we 
We will keep this fort. I don't want this one. Don't want this one. Or this one, and... This one's grassland, so it's not the greatest, but I guess we can keep it. Alright. Now... Oops. Let's core up Pail and Kalei. We need to take a couple missions quick, and then, like I said, we'll be done. Permanent claim on Brittany, Eastern Burgundy, and Western Burgundy area. So we'll grab that. We get some mill power. Gundy in succession. Hopefully we can do that. We'll see. Retake Gascony for the manpower recovery speed. That's going to be huge because we need 9,200 men. 30 months. Uh, so two and a half years just to get even with our manpower, unfortunately. So maybe we'll leave this one army behind. Probably. Don't do this stuff at all. Provence's opinion is at least 150. Maybe we'll improve with Provence next instead. Maybe that's the thing we should do. Low Crownland, we can actually seize land here shortly. Um, I don't care to make Normandy a... a state right now. We're going to be struggling with governing capacity. I just want to get to November since... Uh, I know we can seize land and stuff, and I don't want to forget, because knowing me, I will absolutely forget. Just group you guys all up. Except for the light ships, let's have you protect trade. Oh, where should I have you protect trade? Bordeaux, maybe? And go to port during war. And then the rest of these guys... Actually... Move you to Bordeaux here. We're gonna need this guy, so we'll grab him. But then let's... Move you guys to the pale. And then like I said, oh, stability, beautiful. We are going to do that so we can get it two for the price of one, basically. If we restore the duke, Alan Son becomes an appanage. Uh, no. Royal Marriage from Castile. Uh, I can't believe I forgot to do that. But yes, I will gladly take a Royal Marriage with you. Now, with this guy, let's improve with Provence up to 150. And I don't actually know that we're going to be able to seize land, unfortunately. Extend all these loans. Get you up to... actually... Just keep you here. I lied, doesn't matter. Move you up to Pale. Okay. Um, we could grab Miltech. I'll do that right before we start our war. 
let me come look at our states quick. 43, 35, 64. Yeah, unfortunately, we're not quite going to be able to seize land yet. So, we'll wait. Um... With that then, we are going to be out of time guys, if you guys enjoyed the episode go ahead and click the like button, don't forget to click the subscribe button as well, new content every day at 12 noon eastern time, and we'll see you next time.